you see my socks? Okay, so I have these foresty socks on. Uh, there's a good reason for why I'm not wearing shoes, and I'll get to that. Um, but first, they are foresty because the piece that I'm playing for you today is also foresty. Uh, this is a piece of music that I composed. Uh, it's for solo violin and live electronics. Uh, and it's called Cathedral Grove and the Grey Jay. Okay, so Cathedral Grove is uh, the name of at least two specific stands of trees that I know of. Uh, the one I know best is in Muir Woods, which is just north of San Francisco. I'm seeing some like friendly nods over here. Somebody knows about it. Uh, I used to live in San Francisco. I'm also wearing my San Francisco shirt. Uh, and when I lived there, I loved going to Cathedral Grove. And places like it really inspire me. I just become a different person when I go to places like that. And you can really only get it from, you know, having enormous ancient trees towering over you. I sink into this kind of sense of space and quiet. I start to hear things like wind going through the leaves of the trees. I start to see sunlight filtering, making shadows on the floor. Uh, I hear rivers, I hear birds, I hear creatures, I hear this natural drama that's always unfolding. So in my piece of music, I try to capture some of this natural drama, this rich texture of sights and sounds, as well as my internal reactions to them. Okay, so the thing about the gray jay, here's a gray jay. Oh, <laughs> it's really cute, but it's really hardy. It's really tough, super Canadian. This one time I went on a hike near Vancouver and I was eating my lunch and a frenzy of gray jays came out of nowhere and they were very interested in our food. Uh, and fast forward 10 minutes and they were eating peanuts right out of our hands. I had my recording device with me so I was able to record some gray jay sounds, including their squawks, their whistles, and even their flapping wing sounds. And all of these sounds have ended up in my piece of music. So here's a picture of me recording a gray jay and looking like the bird whisperer. <laughs> okay, there are other natural sounds in my piece as well. We've got a chickadee that's pretty, pretty uh, prominent there. We've got some... Uh, frogs, some squirrels. Uh, <laughs> you also have the sound of wind blowing through trees, thunder, and rain. You can listen out for those things. Okay, back to the socks. The reason I'm not wearing any shoes is because I play these electronic instruments uh, that are here in the stage in front of me, and I simply just like to be able to feel what I'm doing better, uh, you know, when I'm not wearing shoes, uh, I just get this tactile sense of these controls that are in front of me. Okay, I'm not going to talk too much more. If you're interested in talking to me more about my inspiration for the piece, uh, or even what these electronic instruments are doing, please come find me afterwards. Uh, and without much further ado, I hope you enjoy my foresty piece, Cathedral Grove and the Grey Jay. Thank you. 